hello guys welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you demo about how you can use uh, dev tunnels in visual studio to debug your web api in a mobile application so let's uh, go through it here i'm just going to create a new web api project Okay, now let me run this web API project. So by default, it's just going to point to localhost environment. So this is the URL it's pointing. Here I already created one sample Mavi project that just displaying this weather information of this uh, default web, web API project. So let me open that .NET Mavi project. So here in URL, I'm just going to point to this localhost. And here, this observable collection of weather forecast class i am just going to add data here and that i'm just going to display here in ui and here in a constructor i am just calling this cat weather info api and that data i'm just deserializing it and adding it here in weather infos now let me run this in windows platform so if i run this project in windows platform then it's just going to display data because this project also running in the same system so it's displaying data here but if i run this project here in real device so i have connected this android real device now if i try to run so it's just going to throw some error because this local host this real device is not going to find this local local host url Okay, so it throwing error failed to connect to localhost. So for that, like for fixing this, uh, now we can use dev tunnels. Before I used to use IP address. So what is the system IP address that I am just pointing here in configuring here in web APIs and it's like a quite complicated. So now easily you can just create dev tunnel. So just uh, click here in dev tunnels option and create tunnel and just you need to add your microsoft account after that just add the name whatever the name uh, tunnel name you want to provide that just add and here you can select option temporary or the persistent so i'm just going to use same url every time whenever i run project and here i'm just going to set to public as i want to access this url publicly okay now it's Playing message it's a tunnel is created now if i run this project so it's just going to point to new url okay so now this url i can use to display weather info now let me add this url here in dotnet my project so instead of localhost URL, I'm just going to replace with this one. And let me put here debug point also in web API. Okay, so now it's just going to display data okay so here in a web api this debug point executed and here in Android, it's just going to display. Okay, so that way you can easily debug from iOS real device and Android real device using dev tunnels. So that's all for today. I hope you like this video and thank you so much for watching it.